بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ہیلو ویلکم بیک ان دس کلاس وی شیل سی ون دا اینڈرائڈ اپلیکیشن ٹو یوز دی ریڈیو گروپ اینڈ ریڈیو بٹن لیٹ اس کریٹ اے نیو اینڈرائڈ پروجیکٹ آئی کال دس پروجیکٹ نیم از ریڈیو بٹنس ریڈیو بٹن اینڈ آئی ٹیک اینڈرائڈ ٹو پوائنٹ ٹو as uh, the build target and the application name is uh, I call it as a human readable name a radio button and demo the project name as uh, normally given in the reverse domain name therefore I call it as com.hfa.radio button okay set finish and you can see that one in the package explorer one radio button is created i take the this is the package name i gave com.hfa radio button and this is my java file and meanwhile just i run that so that uh, it will take some time to load and i go to the xml layout and i open the main xml right now if you see that this is the text view as i said that the emulator is being displayed one minute so let us minimize this and now i can i can see the x graphical layout and xml layout i go to the main layout i mean xml and here you can see that the width is filling the parent and uh, the height this also i will make it as a fill parent and instead of displaying a string i call it as something say hello world okay i see the graphical layout see that now the blue handles are appearing at the entire parent container now the text is appearing somewhere in the corner therefore i will change to appear it in the center therefore the gravity and i call the gravity is equal to center center all right now you can see that the text is appearing in the center but the size i am not happy therefore i will make the size little bigger therefore i say text size and i take this as uh, something say 35 density independent pixel the hello world right so this layout the text view is is taken entirely i want to add a radio group therefore see that this is a radio button and here if you come down you can see that there is a radio group i drag the radio group on the layout but i can't see that why because the text view is occupying the entire area therefore the radio group is not visible however if i look my xml see that the radio group is entirely available in order to display the radio group also i have to ask the text view to give some room therefore here we use weight therefore the weight is equal to 1 i say now the text view has given room for the radio group now these buttons are occupying lot of space because of the orientation is vertical i want to make it as horizontal therefore again i go and in the radio group i make the orientation is equal to horizontal therefore orientation is uh, horizontal all right now you can see that the orientation is horizontal but the default text is radio button radio button that i will change to this one i call it as uh, the first radio button i call it as red second radio button i call it as uh, green and uh, third radio button i call it as blue now you can see that three radio buttons are there since some gap is there i will take one more radio button i drag it and but it is not displaying therefore i will go to the xml to check out what has happened therefore this radio button is out of the radio group therefore this i cut and i paste inside the radio group therefore here i paste it and i call this radio button i call one more color is equal to gray and since all my radio buttons are 0 1 2 this name also i call it as instead of radio button i call this one is equal to 
a radio button a radio I can 0 1 2 is that therefore I will call this is equal to 3 okay now you can see that uh, my have four radio buttons red green blue and by default the red radio button is on therefore i want to make this back screen back color is equal to red that also we shall do it in the text view i go to the text view and since the radio button is red therefore here i say the background color is equal to red red is given in hexadecimal value so this is red component ff and the green component is zero and blue component is equal to zero now if you see look out the layout is filled with uh, uh, red right this much is over now here only thing is we have to check the ids i the text view has no id i want to refer in the java program therefore this id you copy it and uh, you just your name instead of uh, since we copied this text view we shall call it as uh, txt view okay that is the id and for this radio group it is radio group 1 radio 0 radio 1 radio 2 and this one is radio 3 therefore the four radio buttons one radio group and one text view right this much i save and now sorry this much i save it and now let us go to the java coding now if i go to the java now here we have to add those controls therefore the first control is radio group therefore i say radio group and radio group i call it as r g radio group and one more i call it as a radio button radio button and this i call it as radio button one radio button two radio button three because we have four radio buttons i call it as four radio button one text view and now therefore text view i call it as tv excuse me yes i come back here so the text view this is the tv and here this one is to be added therefore the text view is to be imported all right so radio group and four radio buttons and one text view all right and now this we have to associate therefore after the layout we have to add everything therefore the first one i call it as radio group is equal to and i use the cast operator radio group and uh, this one is find view by id r dot id dot uh, you can see that r dot id dot wait a minute this let me compile it so that it can uh, save the changes it's r dot id dot and here comes the radio group all right so likewise i want to put three buttons so radio button one i use the cast operator radio button and likewise here this one is uh, find view by id r dot id dot r radio zero okay now likewise i want to find the other radio button therefore i use control c control v to paste the remaining radio buttons so this one is two this is three and this is the fourth radio button and here my god so this is zero this radio button is uh, one this one is uh, two and this one is three right and one more thing is that this one is the text view is equal to use the text operator text view and uh, this also find uh, view by id and r dot id dot uh, this one is the text view right so all my controls are over now this we shall implement because i want to implement the activities of the radio button therefore we say implements and which class on check change listener because the radio buttons are changed there are two things one for the command button and one for the radio group this i added the moment you add it from the base class then it gives me a warning that uh, unimplemented methods are to be added therefore un add unimplemented methods therefore here we have here we have the method like uh, what is the on checked change listener so in the on checked change listener what should we do is if this radio button this one uh, this number this argument here i call this one is equal to some variable i and here if i say if the value of i is equal to radio button one dot because both are different this one i, I get the id
already are radio button one the get id and if this one get id if this one is there then for the text view i set the background color is equal to the color class i select the red class the same way we can write for all the other thing therefore i copy this and i paste for the remaining four classes remaining four classes one two three four right if it is equal to radio button two i have to use the green three and this one is a four and in this case this should be my instead of red uh, so this one is what this color is to be imported therefore import the color and here i should use uh, this one so color color dot Red, all right. Now, likewise, here in this case, it should be red and green, and this should be uh, color dot uh, blue, and this should be color dot uh, green. Okay, this event we have attached. Only thing we have to add it is only thing we have to inform that for the radio group, radio group dot set set on check change listener where the function is defined the function is defined in this class itself now let us save it and we shall run the, let us save the application and if i run the application the emulator will come up and now if i unlock this then it should open it takes little time now see that uh, this uh, red is there if I select green or if I select blue or if I select gray, the background um, the text view changes. So since time is very short, I, I went very fast. Right, the remaining thing we shall see in next class. Thank you.